The Asoko residence of Chief Edwin Clark was raided on the 4th of September by four policemen where they got a tip-off by an indigent of Abuja, Ismail Yakubu, that arms were being taken into the residence in some Toyota Hilux vans. DSP Jimo Moshu, spokesperson of the police, said even though the police on a daily basis receives information from members of the public, which is used promptly to prevent and detect crime, the police will not condone any form of misconduct or fake information. Any officer who is to carry out the execution of such warrant must follow the lay down procedures within the law. Where such is not followed, such an officer must be made to face the consequences of violating the rule of law and the rights of and privileges of Nigerians as enshrined uh, in the constitution. The Inspector General Police, according to Moshud, has already sent a high power delegation led by DIG Habil Joshak to Chief Edwin Clark to apologize on behalf of the Nigerian police. The delegation was received by, by the elder statement himself, Chief Edwin Clark, and the apology, the, the tender was uh, accepted by him. The informant, who is an indigent of Abuja, narrated how he got the information, insisting that he has done nothing wrong. Yunusi Yusuf, spokesperson of Abuja Indigent Association, also said it would be unfair for the informant, who acted in national interest, to be prosecuted along the four policemen. Honestly speaking, uh, police, police, that is why they said you should, when you see a suspicious movement, you should always report it to the police. I don't think I have done wrong in those, such doing. Then it was not politically motivated at any point, but it was due to the fact that FCT indigents, once again, we have been peace-loving people and we have been security conscious. It will bear me witness that police have always engaged us to say that we should always report everything that we suspect criminal. So what we are saying is that the Nigerian police should encourage people who are ready to do intelligence gathering, who are ready to provide relevant information. Because, okay, for instance, even our elder Edwin, Click, Edwin Clark, we are sorry about what happened, but if at all the, the FCT is not at peace, he wouldn't be happy living at Asokoro. Ismail Yakubu, the informant, according to Jima Mushud, will be arraigned in court, while the four police personnel who carried out the raid, ASP David Dominic, Inspector Godwin Musa, Inspector Sada Abubakar and Inspector Yabo Paul are in detention and will face the full rot of the law. In Abuja, Abdul Yusuf, Liberty News.